Where are we going? We're about to go movies or not? Do not take your kids to watch this movie! I like magic. What the fuck did we just watch? Half of the fucking movie is about the Joker. Uh huh? But uh, but yeah, it's a decent movie. Hi everyone, I'm Ronan and Chang. I just got back from watching Lamb, the newest A24 film, directed by Vladimir Johansson, and it's starring Naomi Rapace. This film uh, is an odd, interesting film, I think, and my thoughts about it is that if you've seen the teaser or the trailer for it, you pretty much know what's happening for the most part of this film. Um, it's a couple, farmers in Iceland, I believe, who mainly take care of, of lambs or sheep, discover that one of the babies being born uh, is not all sheep or all, all lamb, if you will, that it has the head of, a, of an animal, but it has a baby's body. And they decide to raise it as their own. And I like the film for the oddness and out of the blueness which we rarely get these days unless it's coming from A24 or Blumhouse or any independent film so I like that it was weird and I don't see this too often but I didn't love it I did not love it uh, maybe in second viewing third viewing I might come to love it more but as of now I was excited for it hyped for it thought I was gonna walk down and be like yes and I was just like Okay, that was something. That was something. Um, I think the big things that didn't make me love it were the pacing of it, which may have been intentional, and the fact that I pretty much knew everything, and only every 40 minutes, probably, the movie would get me and be like, okay, I'm, in tr I'm engaged, and then it would go back to default, and then I would be like, all right, we're waiting to, for the next reveal or whatever is going to happen next, a new element. And then 40 minutes or 30 minutes, boom, something happens, element, and then go back to default. Again, I appreciate A24 films. So the fact that they swing for the fences and whether they land or not is up to people's personal choice and thoughts. I kind of read it that it's either what has been shown to us or that it's all a metaphor and it's within somebody's head. Specifically, Maria being played by Naomi Rapace. The film might be about loss and just dealing with it. Or negating the fact to move on. Or it's about denial, possibly. But it's 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 interesting. Usually with some A24 movies, I just leave out of the theater and be like, Oh, I want to talk with people about it. Oh, you know, a perfect example for me is Ex Machina. I saw that. Coming right out of out of work, I just went straight to the theater. It was a semi-packed, almost majority packed house, and I that movie just shook me. And just it is one of my favorite films of all time. And so with the lighthouse, that would just boggle my mind because of the format and all that stuff. But that's my thoughts on Lamb, and I have to sit on it to think about it more. Give it a shot at least to see what you come up with it, and. So A24 can still keep making movies. Because I they have my support. They have my support. The Green Knight. Come on now. If you enjoyed this video for the most part, subscribe to the channel. Uh, let's grow out the community. Like the video. And I will see you in the next picture.